welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here my name is Linda and you are very welcome to subscribe to this channel today we are starting another hair growth challenge and this time this hair growth challenge will take not 7 not 10 not 14 days but 30 days and this hair growth challenge will not include any supplements so let's grow some hair let's grow some hair Okay, well then that happened. Today's star of this hair growth challenge actually is a shampoo. First of all, let's create this DIY, almost, hair growth shampoo that we will use every single day. And then I will talk you through this hair growth challenge routine that I will stick to for the next 30 days. What do we need today? First of all, we need a bowl where to mix everything, of course. Then we need some shampoo. All the things that I will be using will be written down in the description box. It's just an ordinary shampoo and it's a very moisturizing shampoo and I do like this shampoo. Then we will need an empty bottle where to mix our new shampoo. This was an actual shampoo bottle from Schwarzkopf. Then we are going to need some steaming hot water that I poured up in this thermal cup and this steaming hot water will be for some black pepper to make black pepper tea yes you heard it right black pepper tea so these are our ingredients for the shampoo and let's get to mixing this shampoo because otherwise this video will be three days long so let's take our bowl and we will take some black pepper and here we have about a hundred grams. Yes, exactly, we have a hundred grams of black pepper. And I will put all of it. Let's make it spicy. So this is how the black pepper looks like. Little balls of black pepper. Okay, I will stop doing that. Then we take our hot water and here I have half a liter. Okay, and then let's just pour it in. So this is how looks the black pepper tea that we will now close up with a plate like this and we will leave it for about an hour so while we wait for the black pepper mixture tea whatever to get ready let's measure my hair once again i have my tool here let's brush some hair if i remember correctly my last hair growth challenge i did finish up at 55 centimeters So now you can see the full length of my hair. So let's get to measuring. So let's put the pointy thingy exactly by the roots here. And then straight down like this. So you can see, I hope you can see the ends of my hair here. And my hair are 56 centimeters. Like this, you can see, 56. Uh, should we measure again? I think yes. Let's measure my hair again. We have 56 centimeters. And in inches, it is about 22 inches. So 56 centimeters are my hair now. And we will see how long my hair will be then after 30 days of doing everything for hair growth. So first of all, I do wash my hair very often. My hair are really greasy, so if I want them to be clean, I need to wash them every morning. Yes, I wash them in the morning. I know it's not good, but otherwise my hair are greasy if I wash them in the evening. For the next day, they are no go, so I prefer to wash them in the morning. I do not use hair dryer, so I will not use it for the next 30 days as well. So that is not going to change. But there are a few things that I will be doing additionally 
during the next 30 days. So first of all, this shampoo that we will create today, I will be using every single time I wash my hair for the next 30 days. I will still use a rice water that I use every day. If you want to see how I make rice water, I will link the video down below. Then the next thing that is not going to change is my rose water spray. I make it myself. And I spray it on my hair quite often throughout the day. And if you do want to see a video on how I make my own rose water spray, I will link the video down in the description box. Another thing that is not going to change is me using this protein treatment for my hair. I do put it in after every wash. I do use one pump every time. This is how the bottle looks like. Hope the camera can focus. But the thing that is going to change, as this is a super hair growth challenge, is me using hair masks. So when it comes to hair masks, I am a kind of lazy ass on them, especially DIY ones. But this month I want to change it and because I want to get the best results possible after this 30 days, I am going to make a DIY hair mask for the length of my hair twice a week for the next four weeks. Most probably it is going to be a avocado yogurt honey mask that I do like a lot. These are the things that I am going to do the next 30 days. The first ingredient for our hair growth shampoo is this juice and the second ingredient is an actual shampoo. So we need to pour these two things in an empty bottle that I have right here and it needs to be equal. Half of this and half of this. Here we have space for 500 ml, so half a liter. So I guess we take half of this, 250, and the rest we will pour in some shampoo. So let's get to work. And now let's pump in some shampoo. So the shampoo is ready and my other things that I am going to use this month for my hair are ready. This tea that is left here I will make another bottle of this shampoo because I will use a lot of it as I wash my hair every day and probably after first wash that will be tomorrow morning I will come back and tell you how I feel about washing my hair with this shampoo and then we will see how this is going to go and where this is going to take us. I'm not going to say goodbye because there will be another 30 hours of video to watch for you. So see you guys tomorrow, I guess. This feels weird, not saying goodbye, but okay, I guess. See you tomorrow or the day after tomorrow or today in the evening. I'm not sure. I will see you. Bye. Don't go anywhere. Video is not finished yet. Okay, I'm just going to switch off the camera right now. Hey guys, so as you see I just washed out my hair and I did use the shampoo that we created and to be honest I didn't notice any difference, it was like shampooing my hair with any other shampoo, it was not burning, it was not stinging on my scalp and I didn't notice any difference except that I did use a little more of shampoo than I usually would because it is more liquidy because of the tea, the pepper tea so yeah that's the only difference that i didn't notice maybe the tea was not strong enough maybe for the next shampoo because i think i will run out of this one quite fast for the next one i will make it stronger i will see but yeah i will keep on going with this shampoo for the next 29 days and we will see what's the difference hey guys so while editing this video i decided to split it in two parts because otherwise it would be just too long so don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to not miss out on part two of this hair growth challenge that is coming out and next week and i can give you a little sneak peek the results were quite amazing so see you all next week bye bye